Hi, I'm Vadim Pogachev, Chief Technology Officer of Biocom Technologies. Our company is a well-known leader in research and development of innovative products and technologies, including software and hardware for health and fitness assessment, physiological research, and biofeedback based on a new science called heart rate variability. Today we'll talk about how to practically use the heart rhythm scanner to perform specific type of health assessment. One of the most common applications utilizing health assessment based on HRV analysis is evaluation of the effect that occurred over the course of specific long-term treatment. This scenario assumes taking many autonomic balance assessments before each treatment session uh, within the long-term treatment program. Now we will demonstrate a typical scenario of use of the heart rhythm scanner to evaluate the effect of special treatment with inhalation of activated air. A 40 years old female patient was treated in a naturopathic clinic. The patient experienced chronic stress symptoms and frequent episodes of anxiety. The doctor has administered a course of treatment with 20 minutes of inhaling activated air using M3 uh, active air machine, which is known as an effective tool to treat this condition. The heart rhythm scanner was used to obtain the autonomic balance assessment before each treatment session. The autonomic balance test was conducted each time as it was demonstrated in our previous video lessons. Now we will see how the autonomic balance assessment reveals the effect of this course of treatment. Uh, we open the patient record and select the progress report associated with this treatment course. The software shows multiple history graphs indicating the dynamics of specific HRV parameters over the course of nine treatment uh, occurred within eight week period. The following parameters show a typical pattern of improving overall health condition due to long-term stress relief. A decreased heart rate, increased SDNM and RMS-SD. Then, uh, significantly in decreased uh, tangent index, uh, increased uh, normalized high frequency and decreased uh, normalized low frequency and finally significantly decreased uh, low frequency to high frequency ratio. This means that sympathetic activity level has systematically decreased while parasympathetic level increased, which is a typical sign of improving the autonomic regulatory function due to significant stress reduction. Overall, we conclude that this treatment course was very successful. Uh, the patient has confirmed improvement on self-assessment reports. This was a presentation of a typical scenario of using the heart rhythm scanner to evaluate the long-term effect of the course of treatment using the autonomic balance test. As always, Biocom Technologies offers free phone consultations on how to use uh, HRV science to achieve your goals and to help you choose Biocom HRV products that will fit your needs. We encourage you to visit our website at www.biocomtech.com to find more video materials on HRV, uh, various Biocom products and their practical use. Thank you for watching this video and we will see you next time.